guys, Sydney of Sydney Style here. And Devin from Devin Rachel. And this is Petite. And Tall. So thank you guys so much for all your questions. We had so much fun answering them last week. We did, we did. Yeah. With our Dat Cokes. Mm -hmm. um, God, I got all southern there. All right, mm -hmm. so why don't we kick off another Q&A. Bunny's joining us this time. I don't know if you can see her up. She kind of blends in with the yeah, couch. Yeah, she kind of blends in with the couch, too. She does. Okay, first question. Grazy Girl 97 asks, how do you dress up colored jeans with a statement necklace? I, what do you think? I think it's important to keep the rest of your outfit pretty neutral. Mm -hmm. Like, let's say you're wearing red jeans, maybe yeah. like a white t-shirt, maybe a gold necklace with a little bit of blue in it. So you can play with color with your jeans and your statement necklace and keep everything else white, tan, or black. Completely agree. I think you don't want to go overboard, especially, we don't know the color of your jeans, but yeah. assuming they're like red or something, you don't want to go crazy unless you're going to turn everything else down. Yeah, especially the statement necklace, as it says, it's mm -hmm. a statement in itself. So be careful there. Be careful. Yep. Okay. Next question is from Annie. Where would you guys suggest I buy my silk camisoles? I love the look but find that they can be pretty expensive. Is there a certain place that you guys go? Uh, well, I actually just did uh, silk camisoles on my staple series on my blog, and I got it at J. Crew on sale. So since silk camisoles are more of classics, you know, wait till they go on sale, and hopefully yeah. they have them in your size, and mm -hmm. pick them up there. I Yeah, I definitely agree. I found my favorite one um, from Topshop, Ooh, and it was around $80, yeah. so depending on how much you um, have to spend, if you can do, if, do that, I would definitely go for that because it's, you know, it's, Amazing, yeah. but it's that it looks so cute. Yeah, that could probably go on sale too, just like the J. Crew ones. Yeah. And J. Crew had a lot Express of Express has a couple of cute ones they do. too. Mm -hmm. um, and also, you can get the silk look without actual silk, so that's a great way to knock it down to price. Mm -hmm. Just make sure that it's you know loose and, and yeah, pretty. <laughs> so, next question is from Alyssa. Alyssa asks, Hey, bunny, um, I love crop tops, but don't want to seem too slutty by wearing one. I love that you use that word. Uh, are there any tips on how to wear crop tops? properly without looking like you're revealing too much. I definitely think that's that that's a, that's possible. Yeah, I for just sure. um I just did a post on my blog about that and what I did was I wore a pencil skirt with my um with my top and it had a little bit of a sleeve right here so that kind of helped but it was definitely a crop top so you just saw it like a little smidgen of my top or middle half and that I just feel like you know you want to leave the eye, you know, yeah, you want to leave something to, to the imagination. Yeah. Um, I was just at an express fashion show in New York a few weeks ago, and they were showing Holiday, and they did something similar. They mm -hmm. did a sequin pencil skirt that was high waist, which is key, and then the sequin crop top, which I think is such a fun holiday look. And just stay away from showing your belly button. So whatever pants or skirt or shorts you do, mm -hmm. keep it high waist. Yeah, just, yeah, that's just that's not cute when it's like all belly button everywhere. Yeah, it's I mean people do anymore. it, but we don't like it, so we don't suggest oh, it. Don't do that anymore. Okay. Okay. Next question <laughs> is from Rachel, like a name girl. I love pretty blazers, but it's difficult for me to find the perfect print because I'm worried about, I'm worried how to match the print to all my other clothes. Help. First of all, you don't have to worry about matching your print to all your other clothes. No. Second of all, um, we really like a lot, well, we like a lot of similar prints. Um, yeah. I love um, floral prints and Aztec tribally prints. I think those are really fun, and especially when you can get them in cool colors. Yeah, I think color is key. Um, just think about a color that you love and, you know, whether it's paisley or animal prints or tribal, basically mm -hmm. anything goes. Just pick a color that you're comfortable wearing and then use it to dress up jeans, right. black dresses, basically anything in your closet. Yeah, I, I think that's a great a great way to say it. Um, you know, just yeah, stripe that. Stripe blazers are also, I love Oh yeah, stripe, stripe blazers. blazers are good too. Yeah, definitely. and that's a classic one too, which is nice. Mm -hmm. Never yeah. goes out of fashion. Definitely. So our last question is from Allie. Allie says, I love boyfriend jeans. We Me do too, Allie. Yeah. I'm wearing them right now. But I feel like since I'm really short, I look too manly when I wear them. What are some ways to wear them and still look feminine? Well, since I'm wearing them right now. And she looks feminine. Uh, yes. I think the number one thing is a great pair of heels. Um, I'm wearing these fun pink and gold ones. You can really wear whatever you want, but definitely a feminine pair of heels, whether it's you know, a bright color or a stiletto, and then also keep it feminine on top. I'm wearing mm -hmm. this, you know, flowing camisole. It's not silk like we talked about before, but still very, very feminine. Yeah, I definitely think that's key. Um, you don't want to, if you're going to wear shoe, like flats or um, like sneakers, it's going to look boy. Sneakers, it's going to look boy. No matter your height ever, you're going yeah. to look, look like a boy. So 
tone you back. Yeah, and I mean, she wears blazers with it a lot. Uh-huh. I definitely cute. wear blazers. Um, you know, just keep like a sequin jacket. You can always wear some. Yeah, a going out sparkle. top. Yeah, going definitely. out top would be great with it too. I think it's just there's so many options. Dress up with jewelry, lots of gold, yeah. lots of sparkle, mm-hmm. just feminine accents. Yes, definitely. Yeah. So great questions, yeah, guys. Yeah, great questions. Um, we're keep actually them coming. Gonna, yeah. So keep definitely keep them coming because we're going to do one more Q and A episode. So I hope you guys like them. Uh, leave a question or multiple questions in the comments below, and visit our or subscribe to our YouTube yes. channels if you haven't already. Mine's Devin Rachel Style, and mine's Sydney Summer. And you can also tweet us. We've been using the hashtag the PT Show. So that's another way to get in touch. Yep. So we'll see you guys next week. See ya. Bye.